Now our big story at five. After 18 years, the family of Barrett Beck gets one step closer to closure. Today, a judge ruled 61-year-old Dennis Brantner will be bound over for trial for the murder of the 18-year-old back in 1990. NBC 26's Brooke Hafes was at the preliminary hearing as we hear from Brantner for the first time. The only words uttered by Dennis Brantner. Yes, all right, thanks. In a preliminary hearing to decide if there's enough evidence to take him to trial. The state called a witness to the stand for testimony. Detective Nate Lamott gave details about the two decade long investigation, focusing largely on the main piece of evidence linking Brantner to the crime. Nine different prints on five different objects. He also gave a chilling account of his interrogation of Brantner. He started to state that he didn't know, he couldn't remember, maybe he didn't want to remember. Uh, he said, uh, in relationship to dumping the body, Barrett Beck's body, if I did, I did. If I didn't, I don't know. Uh, and then he made a comment, if I did, I'm so sorry. Brantner's attorney argues Brantner is innocent, saying the evidence about the fingerprints doesn't give probable cause. There's nothing in the complaint that puts Mr. Brantner in the Fond du Lac area during the relevant time in question. There are no witnesses who put Mr. Brantner in the Fond du Lac area at the relevant time in question. In the end, the judge ruled the evidence against Brantner is strong enough for a trial. Brooke Hafes, NBC 26. The court is working to schedule Brantner's next appearance. He's being held on a $1 million cash bond.